You know, the dorsal fins, again, on their back, gets very long, maybe five, six feet long by the time they're full grown. Now, their dorsal fins don't have any bones in them to hold them up. Uh, instead, they're held up by dense, fibrous tissue. Uh, and all whales get a lot of exercise, uh, exercise sessions, shows, all kinds of activity. They also get some time for the day to rest at the surface. And when they're resting at the surface, the fin is above water. And uh, it can, over time, curl to the right or the left. However, it starts to grow, it will be that way. Uh, uh, now, our females uh, tend to have very straight dorsal fins. Their dorsal fins are shorter, and so there's not quite as so much leverage uh, against gravity. This is Amy Reese. Ah, and in that, and Safari, two more female whales. Uh, Safari, by the way, is Kamea's big sister. She's almost five years old. And there was Sakari's mom out in the center of the pool, uh, coming out uh, with behavior uh, that is really exaggerated. A spy hop, a spy hop is behavior that whales and dolphins do in the oceans when they get their eye above water to be able to see what's going on around them. Uh, most of the behaviors that you'll see today here or in the show uh, come from natural abilities that the whales have. Uh, many of these behaviors have very significant uh, adaptive uh, implications for them. For example, the breaches where they jump up and land on their side and make a big splash. That's a way whales can communicate, as well as slapping flutes or pectoral flippers. In the center of the pool, we have Luna do a jump. Oh, and it was a back dive. I love it. And this is Sakari now, by the way, uh, again, set with uh, Amy down here to the far right. Uh, a type of breach. Uh, called a back bridge, and that should occur right here in the center of the pool. And here it comes. Wow! That was awesome. Uh, you know, I mentioned earlier how you know, we have loved talking with our guests, uh, we love talking with employees about these amazing animals. You guys along the way are going to have the opportunity to share uh, what you know. In fact, many of you all will be here, or some of you all will be here Thursday for our Truth Talks. Is that right? Yeah? Anybody scheduled to be here Thursday during the day? Okay, great. We're going to spend a couple hours just sharing with you some of the things that we're doing with these amazing creatures and how we care for them and uh, uh, just lots about the animals at SeaWorld. What do we got going on here? Oh, it's a center breach. Two center breaches. Wow. Okay, I think it's just about time for a whale to say goodbye. We're going to have several of our whales slide on up. By the way, if you guys got a camera on or something you want to take a picture, now's the time to focus on the slide up. I'll get out of your picture so you can get a little bit more. There we go. Cara and both of her calves, Sakori on the slide up, and Kamea was kind of hanging out with her. She has not yet learned that behavior. Oh, that's beautiful. Jason, Amy, Shane, thank you guys. And Casey, thank you guys so much for showing up. Always. We really, really 